I think a lot of people thought this game would just kind of come down to defense and toughness. Were they just tougher than you tonight? Yeah, I mean, the way it worked out, they, I mean, there was so many opportunities where they were loose balls, and you know, it seemed like every time that you know we were close to getting a big stop, you know, the ball would bounce off the rim, get tipped around, and end up in their hands. And you know, those are just toughness plays that we didn't make tonight, and you know, we got to get a lot better at going forward. <coughs> And you knew they played good defense, and uh, but uh, did you, how did you feel the offense? Did you handle that, or are you still kind of finding your way a little bit offensively? Well, I mean, we uh, we missed a lot of shots, so the opportunities were there. Just a matter of knocking them down or not. And on the second to last possession there, you kind of looked like you tried to draw a foul. Could you just walk us through there what you were trying to do and, and I guess what Virginia did to really extend you guys away from the hoop? Um, well, I, I made the wrong play. Uh, it was open right away and then just got caught in no man's land a couple times. I should have attacked, get fouled, or score, stops the clock. For either or both of you guys, you guys went 36-31. Virginia called timeout, and they scored on their next eight possessions. What was happening during that stretch? Well, right away after that, um, it was, like you said, 36-31. Next thing you knew, a snap of the finger was 36-36. So everything we built for kind of went away. But uh, there was an opportunity there. I, I think they got an offensive rebound, and then, it, then they hit a three to tie it up there. So just, uh, just got to finish the possession and get the rebound, and maybe it's a different story. Jared, how tough was it defending uh, Mitchell and Atkins down in the post? I mean, they didn't do anything you know, out of the ordinary, nothing that we haven't seen before. But you know, like I said before, they just kind of out-toughed us tonight. And you know, those are two, two good players, two hungry kids that, that work hard. And you know, they got the best of us tonight. And like I said, we got to do a better job you know, playing tougher, playing with more heart next time. Jared, did their uh, their defense force you into doing anything you didn't want to do? Did it take away anything, or what was going on out there? We knew they were a good defensive team, and you know they showed that tonight. But you know at the same time we got some good looks, and you know we knew what they were going to force us into. Um, in the post, they came down and doubled a little bit, or at least showed help. You know quite a bit in the post, and we had some had some kickouts off that. We could have done a better job of moving the ball and moving bodies. You know when they did help down in the post, but. I mean, like I said, it was nothing out of the ordinary. We just didn't uh, execute as well as we needed to. Ben, you weren't able to rebound as much tonight nearly as you've been able to this year. Were they approaching anything differently, or were you just not in position as much? Uh, there were some opportunities. I got my hands on a couple that I missed, but uh, overall, just sometimes the ball doesn't bounce your way as well. Jared, you guys didn't attempt a free throw for like the first 34, 35 minutes. What were they doing to not follow you? I mean, they just play, you know, they play solid defense. Like I said, they're a good defensive team. Um, you know, they didn't, you know, get overly aggressive pressuring. You know, they had enough pressure to take us out of our rhythm a little bit, but they, you know, they're playing fundamental defense. You know, they're a good, good defensive team. They're, you know, moving their, moving their bodies, moving their feet well, and, you know, it's playing good position. Anything else for the players?